The whispering of his name can rekindle hope, and hope is something we cannot allow our enemy to possess. Count Dooku, to Rif Tamsen, on Li Cha during the Battle of Morn Kala, Count Dooku supported the Quarren in their civil war against the Morn Calamari. The Morn Calamari king Yos Kalina had died but the Quarren led by chieftain Nosa Ri contested his son Prince Li Cha's claim to the throne. Dooku dispatched Commander Rif Tamsen as a separatist observer to the Quarren on Morn Kala. Dooku was assured that Chieftain Nosa Ri and his Quarren were with them. In return for supporting the separatist cause, Dooku promised Tamsen that Morn Kala would be his to rule. Under Dooku's orders, Morn Calamari captives from Morn Kala city were enslaved. After the Morn Calamari and Republic received Gungan reinforcements from Naboo, Dooku sent Tamsen reinforcements, but ordered him to keep them in reserve. Dooku also ordered him to continue to hunt down Prince Li Cha and reminded Nosa Ri that the Quarren had to support the war effort if they wanted separatist support. Tamsen also received Karkarodanan forces from his homeworld of Karkaras to secure the separatists' hold on the planet. Despite Dooku's best efforts, his plans to conquer Morn Kala collapsed after the Quarren switched sides after learning that Tamsen planned to crown himself as the new ruler of Morn Kala. Together, the Quarren, Morn Calamari, Republic, Jedi, and Gungans managed to drive the Separatist from Mormkala.